Alzheimer's disease affects almost 1 million people in France and over 15 million worldwide. Without any treatment, this number is set to reach 152 million in the next 30 years. It costs over a thousand billion dollars every year. More than 30 years of continuous efforts of researchers and the pharmaceutical industry were not successful. Alsprotect, a biopharmaceutical company based in Lille, aims to make a difference by developing solutions to slow down or stop neurodegeneration and restore brain function. To raise its value, Alsprotect chose to tackle an orphan disease related to Alzheimer's disease, progressive supranuclear palsy, aka PSP. AZP2006, also called Azabrigent, its flagship molecule not only targets what causes the disease, but also allows the neurons to rebuild their lost connections thanks to a strong growth factor, progranulin. Alsprotect was the first company developing molecules around progranulin, which has recently become the center of attention for the pharmaceutical industry and making it one of the most attractive validated targets for the development of new neurology treatments. This recent interest was illustrated by the $2.2 billion deal between GlaxoSmithKline and Elector, a US-based biotech company. Therefore, Alsprotect is attracting the attention of both biotech and pharmaceutical companies willing to acquire its potentially revolutionary treatment, Ezebrigent. The effects of Ezebrigent have been proven on many animal models, particularly at a very advanced stage of Alzheimer's disease. Alsprotect has accumulated a series of achievements since its creation, such as the first successful clinical phases in the procurement of the orphan status for Ezebrigent, not only in Europe, but also in the United States. After over a decade of successful research and development, the company has now reached a mature stage and is currently performing its clinical phase two for the treatment of PSP, an orphan disease related to Alzheimer's disease. The collaboration initiated in 2021 between the company and the foundation of Adolf D. Rothschild Hospital will allow acceleration in concluding Alsprotect's clinical trials in 2022. L'hôpital Fondation Rothschild a effectivement une compétence pour les maladies neurodégénératives puisque nous avons donc une unité Parkinson qui est dynamique et qui s'agrandit chaque année et nous avons également une unité de neuropsychologie assez dynamique avec de nombreux neuropsychologues qui font des bilans de mémoire pour des patients de la fondation mais aussi des patients adressés en ville et enfin nous avons des bilans d'hôpital de jour pour des bilans de mémoire au sens large. L'arrivée de, de, du traitement par AZP 2006, c'est un, une promesse pour tous ces patients puisqu'il peut y avoir un traitement qui peut ralentir l'évolution de cette maladie, avoir une efficacité sur les symptômes et donc prolonger l'espérance de vie de cette maladie neurodégénérative. Schématiquement, les objectifs de l'étude, donc, c'est vraiment de vérifier la tolérance en premier lieu de ce traitement AZP 2006. Donc, pour cela, on inclut les patients avec une hospitalisation initiale où ils ont un grand bilan. Après, on les revoit très régulièrement, quasi quotidiennement, la première semaine, puis de façon rapprochée pendant trois mois pour évaluer comment ils tolèrent le traitement, s'ils le prennent bien et s'il n'y a pas d'effet indésirable. Au niveau de son mécanisme d'action, il est original puisqu'il joue à la fois sur la progranuline et sur la formation de plaques de protéines taux qui sont impliquées dans la PSP et donc ça pourrait vraiment avoir une action pour ralentir l'évolution des symptômes de la maladie. This important milestone will be followed by proof of concept clinical studies in both Europe and in the USA that could lead to a potential treatment for PSP which could potentially be extended to Alzheimer's disease. Moreover, there are reasons to believe that Ezebrigend and its progranulin-driven mode of action can be applied to additional neurodegenerative diseases. Alsprotect is now extending its development by opening a subsidiary in Boston, USA, with the ambition to raise funds and initiate its first clinical studies overseas. More than ever, Alsprotect remains in the front wave in the fight against neurodegeneration and is now getting closer to a therapeutic solution that could lead to a bright future. Allsprotect, therapeutic solutions for neurodegeneration.